No, I've yeah, I've recently came back to to do a bit of teaching with the uh, the students here, and it's been great. You know, like seeing that uh, going back to to where it, it began for me, and also you know to see the 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 passion and the the talent of the the uh, you know the next uh, batch of filmmakers, if you will. So it's been great, and you know the the standard is very high, and they you know they know their stuff, and uh, that's exciting to to work with them. Making that decision that you are a director or you are an editor or a cinematographer, and then you know going for that, you know you don't need to be. Um, you don't. You don't need anyone else's permission to say that. So, uh, but yeah, like I say, I think that's um, to never get too disheartened. But at the same time, when things are going well, never get too, uh, yeah, carried away, if you will, because it's it is a long journey. Uh, the that of a filmmaker. Now, you know, I'm just at the start of that myself, really. But it's, uh, you know, already there's, you know, there are ups and downs for sure. So it's. It's, uh, I guess, being prepared for that. I've just completed uh, my first feature film called For Those in Peril, uh, which premiered in Cannes uh, last week. So that, that's been the latest step in the journey for me of, you know, completing my first feature film. Uh, so that's, and again, going back to my time here, it's, I think, uh, Hikikomori, which was the short film I made here, was, you know, one of the, a big step into where I am now, for sure. He's had an awful hard time. It's been an awful couple of years for him, and it's yeah. just, it, you know, he's missing his, his, you know, he's missing his brother, and he's. And I know that this is all very upsetting for you, but we, you we need know. to try and move things along. Um, so I've, I've had a, a conversation with um, with a senior consultant, that's Dr. Forbes, and um, because I think we really need to, to sit down and. I'd probably come up with a strategy for Joe, um, right. and if that means that he, he has to come out of the house, then you know, I think that's the way we're going to have to go with it. It was the first short I really made, so it was you know getting that opportunity to write and direct, you know, with a with a crew behind me, and that film then became my calling card for everything that's came since then, you know. It was the first time, uh, you know, you, you had that uh, luxury almost of being able to focus on nothing but making films and, you know, uh, talking about film for, well, it was like two years and it, it made the world a difference really, you know, from um, being, being allowed that kind of space and to get, you know, uh, your own uh, your own thoughts on film and then also your own uh, thoughts on how it, you know, uh, what was possible with cinema and stuff like that. So I think, yeah, and also the, the fellow students I think are as, as important as, you know, the, the, the classes and the, so it's kind of learning from each other and so it was kind of two years of quite intensive, hardcore cinema and film. It made a big difference for sure, you know, in, in uh, where I am now.